Hello and welcome back to Persona 4 Golden. So between last time and this time, I have done a little bit of Persona grinding. By that I mean I filled in some of our compendiums. So if I go here by levels, you'll see at the end, nearing the end, we're all pretty much clear. Now, there are, like, from level 35, I think it, or, yeah, well, be 38 onwards, we have a few gaps. And that's because we ran out of money, basically. So we're going to come back to this a little bit. But we do have a almost full set of personas to have a look at. So, from Narcissus to Fortuna. So Narcissus, Take, Minakata, Sate, Pill Rider, Mother Harlot. Actually, Mother Harlot's one we've already had. Uh, and Fortuna. Yes, I had to make that one to fill some space. Uh, so, Narcissus. Let's have a look here. So, right down this way. Um, I would like it if you do something like... Hey, by order created or something, but hey, whatever. Uh, oh, there we go. I was worried there for a second. So this is an Aeon one. A young man of Greek myth, he rejected the nymph Echo, who faded to a whisper out of despair. Cursed by Nemesis, he fell in love with his own reflection and wasted away. Oh, all right then. So that's one that we missed. Most of them you'll notice are like Aeon or Hunger. Well, two are Aeon and two are Hunger, but you, you get the idea. Um, so Take, I just want, I really wanted to check the level. 31, 36, 38. Okay, 31, 36, 38. So 31, is this one? According to Japanese myth, he fought Take um, Mikazuki uh, for control of Japan and lost. He is revered as the god of hunting. I guess you can tell he lost as he's now got no arms. Okay. Uh, Sati. Shiva's first consort in Hindu myth. She threw herself into the sacrificial fire in protest of her father's treatment of Shiva. Reborn as Parvati, she was reunited with Shiva. Okay. Cool. Uh, pale Rider. One of the four horsemen of the apocalypse, he rides on a pale horse and is the ruler of Hades has the power to destroy life. Oh, all right. And then we have got Fortuna, Roman goddess of luck. Her Greek counterpart is Taichi. Originally a goddess of fertility, she later became known as the spinner of the wheel of fortune. Ah, all right. Uh, and then that, I believe, was all of them. Right, Fortuna, Pale Rider, Sati. Yes, so we're gonna do a little bit of a fusion here just to get a few out of our list. Yeah, we'll just fuse these. I'm not really too worried. I'm probably not going to save the one that we make anyway. Uh, but, I, you know, might as well do something that might be useful. Light attacks are good no matter what level you are, right? Uh, we already have a dark attacker one. Let's give you counter strike and growth two. Sure, something like that. We're probably not going to use this persona, but if we ever find that we really need to try a light attack, it'll give us something to work with. Cool. I believe we've seen this one before. Actually, we can tell whether we've seen this one before or not because uh, when we do the uh, when we go to register, we'll be able to see whether or not we have it. Apt pupil. So what's that? That's uh, don't get crit as often. Oh, increases our critical rate. Ooh, blades of fury looks interesting. Well, we'll maybe keep that one. Yeah, sure, why not? And we didn't get a leg boost, but that's okay. Again, we're not really keeping this one to use it, but. It's got some interesting stuff going on. Now, if I go and check our compendium. Yeah, you see we've got a registered one. Our new one is obviously better because it's actually leveled. So we'll have that. Cool. Right. Uh, we can now leave the Velvet Room. Chuck in a little save. And then we're ready to go find a Dachi. Right. I did make a new save slot just in case something went wrong with the video. But it probably shouldn't. Right. Uh, oh, never mind. Uh, hey, Teddy. Yeah, Adachi. Okay, let me show you the way. What was our group? Uh, our group was... Like, it was Yukiko. Yeah. It was Teddy. And then, I can't remember who was last in our group. It'll be whoever at the highest level, right? Was it Chie? Or... Uh, it might be, yeah, I think it was Chie, wasn't it? Uh, Yukiko, Teddy, and Chie would seem correct, or maybe it was Yosuke? I can't 
remember who it was. And now, but it probably doesn't matter, it was one of them. Uh, it might have been you, actually, due to your buff. Yeah, yeah, I think it was Yosuke. There we go. Right. Uh, although we did get new stuff. Anyway, that's fine, we're going in. Continue from... Go to Magatsu Inaba. World 4, I think? Wait, what's Magatsu Inaba? Now, I did save, so if this is horrible, I can go back. But where, what is that? I think this... I'm not sure. Wait, if I go forward here... Is this the one we couldn't get through, or...? I think this is the one we couldn't get through for whatever reason. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, that's fine. I'm not entirely sure what Magatsu Inapa is. Right. I think World 4 is the one we're after. Or is World 4 the... See, now it's confusing me. Yeah, Magatsu Mandala. Yes, that's what we're after. Also, we're in a new outfit. We'll read the stuff later, but we're in the Cheer Squad outfit, I believe. Although, we could also... Just thinking about it, we did have some more ones. Um... Also, I just noticed that Teddy's one is the, um, is his uh, cross-dressing one, which is kind of neat. Right. Uh, we did get some new stuff as well, though, didn't we? We got, oh, we got our Juness outfit, that was it. Yeah, and deep blue cloves, though. That's kind of neat. I mean, it's very stupid looking. I think I might go back to the, uh, you know, I, I quite like hard-boiled. Stick with hard boiled. Yeah, everyone else can stay the way that they are for just now. Right. Not worried about the enemy. We'll leave it be. Is this, is this an item room or is this. This looks like it's gonna be a dead end. Uh, attack! Don't get. Oh, okay, I got caught. Well, this might be an immediate end. Oh, that's not good. Darkness won't work. Nice miss. Thanks, Fade Ice. Oh, nice move, Yosuke Senpai. Okay. Really good. So what are these guys this weak to? No yourself. idea. Okay, well, first move. Hmm. Uh, Zeodyne? Nope. Oh, they then immediately used it on someone else. But I don't think, I think that was a coincidence more than anything else. Wind? Double reflect. Hate that. Oh, and, a, and a, a double reflect and a drain. What an awful first turn. Okay. Thank you. Appreciate it. Um. Ice. Perfect. Reset scan. Looks like it's weak to ice. That reset scan is very useful. I appreciate it. You hit the enemy. Let me handle this. Sure. Nice. Oh, nice. Get him. It shouldn't kill, Action. but that's okay. We're at least doing damage to them, which is more than we did before. Okay, uh, fire is probably not going to do great, so I might try our heal. Now, we did get rid of our 50% our heal stuff, but let's see how this goes. I mean, it still seems to be pretty good without the 50% extra heal. Right, let's hit them with Heavy Almighty. That should kill two of them. Yeah, perfect. Nice block. Attack. Someone else's turn. One. Resist Go that one, it. huh? You can hmm. forget about using well, I guess we could just use ice, right? Given it's weak to ice. Cool. Oh, there's the enemy number two. No way. Four more enemies are here. There, got it. Don't worry. It's weak to physical attacks. Oh, all right then. That's cool. Uh, I guess I will attack one. Nice. nice moves, then do the same to this one. Give me another. Sk also, it's dodge physical. All right, that makes sense. Four of them. You need to Attack it. Enemy down. Cool. Yeah. 
Uh, what do you reckon about these guys? Do we know anything about them? Nope. All right, let's try attacking them. Resist. Okay, fair enough. We don't have any AOE um, physical right now, I've noticed. Hmm, we should maybe work on that. That's terrible. Okay. Uh, well, I guess you could. Although, first of all, let's go for a gigantic fist. Um, yeah, I guess she can heal herself. Hmm, that didn't go so well. Right. That one dead? Not quite. Okay. Uh, let's try this one. Just hit them all for a lot of damage. Should get two kills and two hurt. Yeah. Okay. Do I know what these guys? Anything about them? No. Okay, uh, let's go for AoE wins. Let's see. Neutral. I'll take neutral. Oh, hello, what are you doing? All allies attack increased. Oh, that was very nice of you. I appreciate it. Uh, yeah, I'm still immune to physical. Thanks for asking. Um, let's try ice. Cool. Try fire. Fire heals them, just for whatever reason. Nope. Okay, that worked. We got shuffle time. Shuffle time. Okay, uh, yeah, I'll get my SP back. Why not? And we got a ton of XP. Level 69. That's a level up for Yosuke. So you got Maru, so it's heavy wind damage to everything. Yeah, cool. We'll definitely use that. I don't see any reason why we wouldn't use that immediately. Ooh, did I level, up? level 59 for Yukiko, which is a new thing. Re revives an ally with full HP. Okay, what would we give up? Oh, I didn't get rid of the 50% magic. I see. Hmm. I think we leave it for just now. Yeah, I think we forget that. Teddy has it anyway, if we really needed it. So, that's fine. We're getting there. Right. Although maybe I should have, because if you look at the next one that she's going to learn. Uh, ah, I just noticed that one there. The, ne the next one that she's going to learn, but we couldn't see it before. Which is, uh, is fully restores party HP. So I should have got rid of Divine Grace, because it's now useless. But hey, whatever. Hey, we got a lifestone. Nice. So we're going to head this way, then a sharp left and followed by a left for more items or a right for no more items. Hmm, don't know where this goes. Oh, this is just the way out? Yeah, let's take the way out. Why not? Namatami is the serial killer. That's what society accepts as truth. Everyone's fiercely latching to it. Let's say you guys catch me and that truth is proven false. What do you think will happen then? Don't you get it? It's simple. They'll simply latch onto that instead. Nothing about them or the world will change. That's the truth you're all looking for. Gee, what a smart ass. What's with this guy? He can blabber about logic and try to dodge the truth all he wants. What he's done can't be forgiven. We'll make him pay for his crimes. Let's go, senpai. Alright. Sure. Alright, we got one in here. Ah, uh, we need to fight this one. Just looking at the angle, we maybe could have run past, but Be careful. that's a cool tank. Ice enemy. Um, that is a cool tank. Do we have a persona with AOE physical? We must have something, right? You don't. Uh, Vorpal Blade? Yeah, okay. We'll go for our uh, snippy snippy cut cut one. I hate myself for saying that phrase, actually, but here we go. Vorpal Blade. And it crit. Hey, I got you back. On you go. Perfect. Get him. Are you ready? Yes. That was about the best turn you could possibly hope for. We knocked down two with weak, one with a crit, and then we got a uh, friend to help. Oh, resists almighty damage, and we got these two with Juness Bomber. Well, now we're just down to the tank. 
which I assume is the one that was immune to uh, ice. Let's try uh, heavy wind. Neutral. Okay. Um, I'm still going to try ice, even though I think it's the one that's immune. Yeah, that's fine. Fire is its weakness. I know you can win. Oh, perfect timing. Thank you for that one. Enemy down. So what we want to say is no to that because it's uh, resistant to um to almighty damage. I couldn't do it. Didn't manage to dizzy it, but that's okay. Ragnarok. Uh, thank you for taking the hit for me. I appreciate it. I guess that means it would have killed me, which is very nice that she did that for us. Um, okay. We will now heal her for that, or more correctly, we'll get her to heal herself for that. Oh, and heal us while, while she's at it. Okay, um, let me just check that persona that we had there. So, yeah, okay, not immune to physical like most of ours. Ah, okay. That's a slight issue. Just trying to see where we want to go here. Don't really want to fight that one. Yeah, I really didn't want that. <laughs> okay, that's even worse. Uh -oh. that one's immune to darkness. Physical wall. Physical wall. I think I'm going to try and escape. You scan. You can beat it. It's weak to electricity. Uh-huh. Three enemies left. Now's your chance. Run. I think I made the correct choice. <laughs> Instead of letting them get an attack in before us, we would just run away. Ooh. Proper chest. Let's crack we to open. Angel skirt. Okay. Let's have a look here, um, Yukiko, as you're the only one who could use it right now. Reduces physical damage 20% and a high evasion. What's your current one give you? Five magic. Yeah, I can't really beat the five magic. Although, that is a tough... Actually, looking at it, that is a. I was just thinking about it for another second. That is a ridiculously high amount of defense compared to what she's got on right now. And a 30% evasion. Yeah, of course we're going to use that. Means also she's pretty much immune to ice attacks because she triples evasion on ice attacks. And if she has high evasion to start with, that's fantastic. Cool, we got that one. I think we should be fine. This seems like the right way. My uh, nose knows. I think this is it. There we go. Told you. My nose knows. It's the right way. Let's go. Huh? A dead end? Hmm. There's something in the center of this area. Ready, senpai? Is this it already? Interesting. Well, that's okay. I see it probably just allows us to get the key, which then allows us to go back to the previous area or something like that. I'll do a quick scan. Electricity is its weakness. Keep at it. Uh Lilith? Lilith, yeah. Okay. Three enemies left. So we'll hit you it with this. one of these to start <gasps> with, because that'll at least hit the other two while we're at it. Cool. Do it again. Just trying to get some heavy damage down. I think they're all going to be neutral to this one, so let's try that. Two enemies left. Yep. Uh, well, they resisted it, but we still killed them from it. Immune to that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're. I think I'm just going to reduce your defense. Yeah. That'll work. And then when we hit them with fire, that'll be perfect. Uh, yeah, we'll do heavy fire to each individually. Do that again. Sure, let's try this. It probably won't kill them, but we'll try it anyway. Hmm, shame. Yikes. Well, at least we can survive that sort of thing. Uh, yeah, do that. Here we... Wonderful. Shovel time. Ooh. Uh, give me new cards. Uh, I think I'll just take that one. Yeah, we'll just take Restore. That's all we really need. Lilith got a level up. Yosuke got a level up. Cool. 
Right. Um, just want to check. Oh, we're, we're pretty much full apart from Teddy. We're actually very full on SP. We're, we're, we are full on SP. Wow. Okay. Love it. That's what I like. So in the center of this area, there's something. So we're going to go left soon. Okay. I might as well hit it. Let's see here. Ooh. Ooh, a rare one. That one's totally weak. Better not lose. I don't know what is weak to, though. It's probably weak to Almighty. Let's go for Almighty. Okay, that did a lot of damage. Don't give up now, okay? Um, raise our hit and evasion rate. Try and get them to fall over. Cool. Um, you can lower their defense. Hopefully we get um, one of Reese's little things. Perfect. That's what I love to hear. Weak to fire. Hit it. This is my chance. Sure. I, go. I don't know what you're going to do, but do it. Not one down. down. Okay. Let's do it back up again, but that's fine. Raise their hit evasions. Okay. Mind charge. Then we'll try and hit them with really, really powerful uh, almighty damage next turn. It got back up. Defeat it fast. Well, we countered, which is great. Keep it up. Um... Heavy wind damage. See how this goes. Well, he got countered. That is bad. Yep. Raise party attack for the ones who are left. One escaped. Um. So repels at least one thing. Well, we know this one's weak to fire, so uh, we might as well fire it. Attack, go for a crit. I couldn't do it. Didn't work. Afflicted with panic. Okay. Heavy magic almighty damage. That'll do it. Nice 11,000 hit. Okay, we got 15,000 experience and 15,000 yen. It's a level up for our uh, Okuni Nushi. Uh, no. Uh, let's see here. Not that we're ever going to use it. You know, we're never going to use its electricity. We might use its white, uh, its light magic. We're never going to use electricity. That's a level up for Amaterasu. Nice. And for uh, Kamui. Oh, and for Reese's Himiko. You'll now be able to successfully escape from almost all battles. Lovely. It's not even a thing we have to equip. It's just permanent. That's what I like to hear. Hey, how did you like your XP, uh, Yosuke? Oh, you, you didn't get any? All right, I should just mind charge for those guys. Like, mind charge almighty will just do the job. Like, every time. Just double checking Trumpeter was equipped. Uh, yeah, we'll hit it. That's fine. Fire, fire, don't know the middle one. That's not good. It's a strong one. Don't lower your guard. That's too much HP. Now's your chance. I'm gonna leave. <laughs> that HP is 5,000 something. Actually, that you know what that probably means? It's probably an enemy that drops an item that you need for a quest. But we don't have the quest yet, so we can't get the item. That's probably what it is. And it's one that will take me uh, months to find. Here comes a pick -me -up. Ooh, what are you giving us? All allies attack sack. increased. Do a quick scan. And then, is we tell electricity. You're very you useful. This. Okay, let's go for a Maziodin. Persona. Alright, do it again. Didn't make him dizzy, but that's okay. Uh, perfect timing. Weak to wind. Alright. Um... I don't know what I want you to do. Probably just attack this one. Uh, does that mean it's got a... Uh, it just repels physical. Okay. That's fine. Um, let's do medium fire. 
Nice. Amazing, Yukiko Senpai. Two defeated then so just far. a little bit of wind. Nice. That's my truth. Didn't get a shuffle time, but that's okay. I'm looking for a shuffle time to get my SP back up, but we'll cope. Yeah, crack it. Gale Vow, is that increased wind damage? Um, so you currently have the Barbaric Bracers, which is doubles uh, chance of dodging attack. Uh, Gale something. Uh, it's in here somewhere. Gale Vow. Increases wind damage by 40%. Alright, I'll take that. He seems to have a more powerful wind attack now. That seems like a good idea. We got it. Run. At least that, that guy isn't rare. I guess, actually, maybe you're meant to kill him with... I'll try it, okay? With light magic. And then we can run. Right. Switch in. Uh, Mahama. Okay. Let's just try and fight one of these once. See what's going on with it. Oh, we do do a thousand damage as, uh, for a hit there. That's not too bad. Um, ice. Uh, let's do a heal. That means Yukiko and um, yeah, and Yosuke both get the heal. Wonderful. Uh, I might switch back to the Trumpeter here. And then Mind Charge. Perfect. Ooh, everything went up. Okay. Let's raise our hit evasion. So we have higher evasion chance. There we go. Um, ice. Didn't do quite as much as I wanted it to, but that's okay. Oh, because it raised its defense. It's okay. Um, this one. Severe uh, almighty damage. I didn't even do as much as it sh I wanted it to. Okay. Uh, heavy wind. Some thick skin. I don't know if it's going to be worth killing this thing, but that's okay. Decrease its defense. Nice. Uh, do a little heal. Wonderful. And then... We'll just hit it with one of these. 800. What are you giving us? More attack? Yeah, okay. That's cool. Yeah, those went back up again. Wind. 800. Defense reverted on us. Uh, let's try get a gigantic fist. That did it. Okay. So we got some mount. We're now level 70. Teddy leveled up as well. Cool. We're leveling up quite quickly, which makes me think that we're underleveled for the area. That'd be my natural guess. You know, level up quickly, therefore, probably something going on. Is this just a spiral inwards? With enemies all the way along? I think it is. Yeah. Hmm. Uh -oh. that one you know, I don't need to fight uh, any more of those large guys. It's weak to physical attacks. Yeah, but it just gave itself physical immunity. Run. I think I'm just gonna leave all of the ones that look like robots. They're a little bit of a pain. I also really hope that it doesn't say like, hey, there's a boss in the center here. Because that would be difficult to deal with. Let's hit it behind, so at least we get to go first. Look out, it's immune to physical- Ah, it's a no. Uh, weak to ice. I might just mind charge and then think about what we're doing next turn once we know it's, what it's weak to. Um, your weaknesses. You can win this. Oh, it's wind. Ah, well. Oh, two of them reflect. That's a really bad move that I just did there. I should have used the single target. 
Uh, use this one that gives us all extra evasion. And hit. Cool. You've got ice as a weakness as well. Alright then. That's the wrong one to hit. Because uh, you don't get another turn. At least we managed to make it... Um, yeah, we managed to make it dizzy. Nice reflect back. Okay, so do we have something that does ice? Uh, wait a second. Are they weak to anything else? You can win this. I haven't tried Dark. I could try Lilith with one of these. Wait, Lilith doesn't have anything that does that. Hm. All right. Uh, your Vorpal Blade. Ah, yes, Nidhogg. That'll do it. And then try Dark. None of them were weak to it, but at the same time, it did its job. Nidhogg leveled up. Jiraiya leveled up. Amaterasu leveled up. Cool. Right, we should be back on Trumpeter now if I check it. Yep. Neat. Grab this one. Uh, we should quickly just heal up Yosuke there. Saving a little bit of SP by using the uh, Lifestone. Yeah, this just is a spiral inwards. There aren't any enemies spawned yet, but they spawn as you walk down the corridor. Wonderful. We'll just run. We can always escape if it's too dangerous anyway. As long as we attack first. Okay. It wasn't chasing us, which is why we didn't hit it. Look out. I'm just going to escape because there's a uh, red one as well chasing us and I don't feel like fighting it. Okay, cool. Keep moving in. Right. Careful. That one's totally weak. Better not lose. They're all fairly weak to uh, it's nothing in particular. Uh, we could just try our uh, AOE, yeah, AOE almighty damage, that might work. Yeah, okay, that kind of worked. Uh, AOE wins, none of them are immune, so that's huge. Bit annoying. We live that, that one, okay. Nice dodge. Doesn't matter. Okay. Uh, just attack. It's so stubborn. I just deliberately didn't do anything with him there because I'm like, doesn't have any AOE currently. Might as well just ignore it. So they uh, reflect that one, huh? The fact it said reflect as I was doing it. That's some thick skin. Yukiko Senpai needs help. Okay. Ice. And shuffle time. Undeserved, but give us restore. Ooh, I haven't seen this one. Bell figure. Yeah, I guess we'll grab that one. It's okay. We didn't get any restore of um, MP and HP, but that's okay. Lilith leveled up again. Okay, that's to be expected. She does have uh, full XP on. So, that kind of makes sense that she would get a lot of that. Heal, heal. Right. Uh, this way? So this is our door into the center. Ah, it's really annoying. So this being a boss is annoying because it means that we would have to run back through this section to get back to where we are. As in, um, we would have to run through and get all of that SP again. Or all of that um, XP again, I should say. Do we have any SP here? We have 5 SP from that. We have, some, we have a cough drop, a, gu a gummy bear, some cookies, caramel drop, pulsating stone. I think I might use that as well. I'll leave that one. Do we have anything else? Like uh, tomatoes, I think, are the other one. Um, they're going to be down in the next section. There we go. Tiny soul tomatoes. Cool. Something like that will work. Right. 
Well, now we just need to trust that we're strong enough to do this. Let's go. Oh, it's a second mini boss. Interesting. This is it. If we beat it, it should do the trick. Let's go, Senpai. Okay. Uh oh, that one's immune to darkness. Two panics. Oh, okay, not good. Right, let's give everybody increased uh, dodge and hit. That seems good. Teddy turned against the party. That's just annoying. Okay, no issue. Uh, we have this one. Cures all ailments in the party. Sure, that seems like a good one to use. Nice, we're back. Okay, mind charge. We don't know what they're weak to, so I'm just going to use mind charge to start with, and then we'll think about it. Right, let's try wind. Why not? Resisted. Okay. Fair enough. Let's lower its defense. Just as a general thing, I think we should lower defense first. It might be weak to ice, but we'll do that. Heavy almighty damage. Hey, not bad, Teddy. Okay, we had a couple dodges. Uh, I'm going to try fire here. Let's see. Resisted. Okay. Let's use our version of what he just did. Okay, they did 300 damage. Yeah, yeah, I know who's gonna heal her. Give me a second. Uh, boss doesn't have any stat bonuses on it. Nope, okay. Uh, power slash? Just try hitting it with, you know, something else. That seemed to work. Okay, I was not, you know, unsuccessful. Heal. Probably want to raise our attack next. That's amazing. I like the dodges we're getting going on there. That's cool. Uh, so we've already tried fire. I'm going to heal on this turn as well. Just to knock us back up. So that should mean Ted. Yeah, Teddy and you are scaring our back up. Awesome. Right. Let's try electric. We haven't tried that yet. Absorbs that one, of course. It's I mean, there's a chance it is weak to something, you know? It does mean that there is a chance of that being true. Let's use this again. I know it's only going to extend it, but uh, I think this was the last turn it was on anyway. Right. Thanks for the attack increase, I appreciate it. That's good. Defense reverted. Uh, I do actually want to increase the party's defense again, although it is using almighty damage, which probably doesn't affect defense, like, isn't affected by defense, but that's okay. Trying it again. That's amazing. Okay. Uh, heal. And keep at it. So, we know that it is... Let's see... So it drains electricity. Let's switch a persona up to not that one, but Lilith maybe? Lilith and then we'll try, we could try our magic barrier on Lilith actually and just reflect that back at itself to start with. In fact, if I apply that to everybody, that'll probably just work, right? Um, so that's on. So let me just check. So, yeah, we can do physical against it if we wanted to. Yeah, use Power Slash. At least there's a chance it crits. Someone else's turn. Okay, try Ice. Just so we've tried it once, because it's bugging me that we haven't tried it. Resist it. it. Okay, defense reverted. That's amazing. That did not reflect it. Okay, so that doesn't count as a magic attack. Interesting, because our magic boost worked on it, like mind charge worked on it, but it doesn't count as a magic attack for this case of uh, a magic reflective barrier. Huh. Okay. Interesting. Uh, so we've tried electricity. That's heavy on mighty. Okay, so there's no point trying Lilith anymore. Uh, what, what have you got? Wind boost, heavy vorpal damage. 
mind charge isn't that useful. You really need physical a physical charge move. Uh, we could try darkness. Yeah, okay, I'm gonna switch to Mother Harlot. Who nullifies darkness, which is good. I just want to double check that it nullifies darkness before I do this. Because if it reflects it, then that's bad. Blocks it. I kind of suspected it might block. It probably blocks light as well. But, you know. It's worth having a look, you know? Nice counter. Alright. Uh, lower its defense. That's fine. We'll raise our attack. I think we might just hit it with attack moves from now on. That's amazing. Ow. Okay. Heal up. I was just testing out things. I think we're just going to hit it with the high attack moves. Now we do have one that actually hits for... It's a physical one, isn't it? Blades of Fear. That's, that's the wrong one. Although it could be the right one. It's Vorpal Blade, so I'm looking for it. Yeah. Let's just hit it with one of these. Vorpal Blade. Nice. Nice counter. Someone else's turn. Attack reverted. Hit evasion reverted. Defense reverted. Defense is the most important one out of those. Okay. Do I get a heal before it gets a turn? You're going to raise our attack. That's okay. That's because it just ran out. Oh, we're charged up and focused. Oh, does that mean our next hit's going to do more damage? Ow. Oh, hello. Appreciate you dropping in again. And you recovered our HP slightly. That's nice. Well, I'm definitely going to try uh, hitting again for a lot of damage now. If we're charged up and ready. Uh, Orpal Blade? Let's see how this goes. I love the miss. It's like, we get extra attack. No, we don't. This is a kind of badly done fight, as in on our side, but that's okay. Uh, let's increase our defense, or sorry, our attack. There we go. So now we have an attack up again. We reflected it back, but it didn't do anything. Oh, I like the wake up slap. Okay, um, I hate it. Okay, I think we'll live, but we might want to heal on our turn. I definitely want to heal on our turn now. Power Slash. Come on. Hit it. Someone else's turn. Good damage. Okay. Let's drop in a heal on us because otherwise we're in trouble. We got double attack up. Nice. So that definitely stacks. Good. I wasn't sure where the Reese stacked. Sheesh. I love that Here. she just goes over and slaps Teddy each time. It's like, no, you will wake up. We did it. damage. We have done damage. Okay, Vorpal Blade. That is countered pretty much every time. It's horrible. That's some thick skin. Okay. Defense reverted. Reapply increased party defense. This is your job, Teddy. It's just buffing up non-stop. Three turn buffs that you apply over and over again. Oh, she's got panic. That's really bad. We're panicked. Please unpanic us. We're charged up and focused. Okay. <laughs> that was a good one. Uh, I actually think we need to heal, unfortunately. I was thinking maybe we could use Teddy's turn to revert them, but we needed to heal. Yeah, I think healing was the right move. Turned against the party. Teddy, are you okay? Someone heal him. Right. Um, we might take a turn to just use like wind. That's okay. Yosuke turned against the party. Teddy. Uh, I would definitely heal. 
and then hope that they snap out of it. Live. Teddy was stood. Yukiko was uh, Yukiko is now back to normal. She can now heal everybody up to full. Well, not quite, but you know, almost. She's getting there. Right, mind charge. Then we'll hit him again. I might switch back to our uh, better one as well. I was just trying out things. Obviously not everything's working right now, but that's okay. There's some plans that we got going. And some things work, some things don't. Right. There's that, def that was said defense reverted, so we will uh, reapply defense. Nice. Right in time for it to hit us. Hey, not bad, Teddy. Uh, we do need to res her. But we don't need to res her. Someone else can res her. Okay. Uh, why don't you res her with a revival beat? Perfect. Uh, here, decrease foe's defense. Right. Wonderful. I love that it missed everybody. Okay, um... We may just try attacking you. Actually, attacking seems to be so much better. Alright, you know what? From now on, I'm just gonna use basic attack. On this boss. Okay. Go for it. That's so much more efficient. That's just amazingly better. Okay. I should have been using that the whole time. All right. Instead of trying to use all of the physical damage ones, I can just hit them with the uh, sword and it works. Charged up and focused. Hi, counter, huh? That's an annoying one. Hit evasion rate reverted. Okay, well, reapply hit evasion rate then. Yep. Okay, defense reverted. Reapply defense. It's not an SP light strategy we've got going on, I'll admit. SP wise, definitely use a lot of it per fight. We are now panicked, which means that unfortunately, we do not hit the boss. Annoying. Hit it. We get. We okay, did it. Let's go. We actually did so much more damage when we just attacked. We got 13,000 XP. You got null wind. That's actually probably worth having, because that one, we if we ever come into a wind attack, which is a problem, we can push it along. Uh, let's get rid of electric damage. We're never using it for electricity. Okay. Sure. Aha, level up. Seems good to me. Have Jiraiya level. I'm at Teratsu level. Teddy got his new one. Mabufudine. Uh, which can replace Bufudine, which now means that Teddy has an AoE attack at long last, which is huge. So now he can actually attack people in a, an AoE situation. Yes, the power's getting weaker. Might be able to pass through that place now. Let's go back, Senpai. Okay. Uh, we have to leave the dungeon anyway to re-enter... Okay, so I think we re-enter Inaba there. Yeah. So let's head back to the fox. Yeah. Ask for healing. Cool. Do a save. Yeah. Right. Go back here. Go to Adachi. Now. World 1 is Mandala World 1? Let me have a look. Because if it is Mandala World 1, we can just walk back out again. Yeah. That's fine. Stay here. So, the other one, this is the Inaba one, which should allow us to enter that, that extra area. Cool. Oh. Also, while we're here, I knew that we just used our SP, but that's okay. Uh, I should have hit it. There's no reason not to hit it, even if I'm not going to fight it. Be careful. There's an enemy immune 
Welcome to light. Okay. Oh, nice move, Yosuke Sam. Now's your chance. That was what I was gonna do, but uh, I should always hit it anyway, so we get the first move, so I can do that first. Because I can just do that first. Uh, let me see. Uh, Persona. Yeah, we're still using Trumpeter. Awesome. Right, we'll open that up. Open. Just keep running. Don't need to worry about them. Ooh, shadows inside it. No, it's just a bomb of life. Nice. Okay, do we have to go through all of Inaba? Uh, or do we just need to go through this one bit? I think we probably need to go through it all. I, we got stuck on the scenery. Be careful. There's an enemy I didn't really mean to fight it. Oh, nice. There we go. Now's Run away. Run. Yeah, okay, let's do another heal. Luckily, Teddy's heals cost pretty much nothing thanks to his item currently. Right, head this way. I think it's this one. Just feel in this way. Yeah, that unlocks to another room. You can sneak behind it. I need to go more to the left. That was not what I was looking for. Divine Pillar. Did we get it? We got it. Perfect. Run. Now's cool. Your chance. Run. I know we're not getting any XP by running, but that's all right. What's Divine, uh, whatever it is, do? What's it do? Divine Pillar. Lowers damage taken, but prevents dodging. It seems like a kanji kind of item, if you know what I mean. Like, um, somebody who's going to wear high armor that gives them pretty much no dodge chance. You just give them some, and he has high health. You just give them something defensive. Yeah, that actually seems really good. I don't know how much defense it gives, Now's though. Your chance. Run. Actually, you know what it probably does? It probably gives you one defense level up. Because the that's the way that uh, these kind of things work. Or, like, that's how all the buffs work in the game. So it's probably, like, one level up. Yep. Now's your chance. Run. Run. We do get to go first. I think that's because of our agility. Agility is what determines turn order. So maybe that's why. Yeah, yeah. So we still need to climb the uh, Inabus side. That's what I thought, which is why I'm kind of just go going for it. Uh, that's fine. Then this is the one that has no exit or something. Or no way forward. That's how it's described. Yep. Now's just run away. Run. That's fine. We don't need to worry about it. Right. And keep going. Yeah, so it was like straight forward and then to the left. We were to fight nothing on this floor. <laughs> that was what he told us. And then we got to the end and it was like, aha, tricked you. That was it. Now I remember. No, nope. not Now's gonna fight chance. you. Run. I have no interest in uh, combat with you. I don't think it's that way. I think it's this way to the left and up. Yeah, I think it's this way. Is he going to be mad that we fought things? Probably not, because he didn't remind us again. It's probably just flavor text. And even if he is, what's he going to do about it? Alright, I'll hit it. I was thinking about it there. I was thinking, how do we get past it? We just hit it in an escape. Your chance. Run. A certain escape might be the worst ability the game has ever given me. Because now I have like, nah, I'll just run. I'll grind later, is my new thought. We did it, senpai! It's open! Alright, we've got him cornered. Let's get him! Where's this go? Oh, it's the other way. Okay, that's fine. Is this the boss floor? I think it is. This is a cool angle. Dachi is just up ahead. This is it, senpai! Let's go. Wow, I'm surprised you made it this far. Allow me to confirm the crimes you've committed thus far. You had suspicions that this world was dangerous, yet you threw Mayumi Yamano into the TV. Knowing full well that Miss Yamano died here, you did the same to Saki Konishi. <sighs> 
Not only that, but you duped Namatame into taking over your murder attempts while you watched like a spectator at a game. When the disappeared stopped dying, you sent a warning letter to ensure more victims. Even when a copycat killer arose, you had the gall as a detective to eliminate a suspect under investigation. Two people died in the last six months, and a young girl is now in critical condition. But that's not all. If at any turn something had gone wrong, many more would have succumbed. All for some foolish excitement, like a criminal reveling in the chaos he creates! Yeah? So what's your point? All I did was put people in here. It's the world that really kills them, isn't it? This world reflects people's thoughts. Which, oh dear, does that mean the real culprits are everyone on the outside, including you? Hmm, that is that is a stretch, Adachi. To hell with that! I didn't expect him to go, well, isn't society at fault? I didn't expect that as his argument, but you know what? Makes a lot of sense. You did that stuff knowing full well those people were gonna die! If that's not a crime, then what is?! <laughs> You're so self-righteous. How can you say that? Aren't you a police officer? Out of everything you could have been, didn't you specifically choose to join the police? <laughs> Don't make me laugh. Just because someone joins the police doesn't make them some kind of agent of justice. You know why I applied? So I could legally carry a gun. That's all. You'd be surprised how many are like that. I thought it would be fun, too. But to tell the truth, that was a wash. Everyone around me was such an idiot. I made one tiny mistake, and they all got on my case and sent me out here to Nowheresville as punishment. I was bored shitless and wondering what to do next when I discovered this power. For crying out loud, why a bastard like you? A gift for having to put up with this lame job out in Nowheresville, I guess. I did that stuff because I could, and it got interesting, so I watched. That's your reason? You can't be serious! You really don't care what happens to our world? Let's be honest. There's nothing great about the real world, is there? It's just dull and annoying as hell. No one accepts that's the way things are. They're just stuck with it because they can't deny it either. Those who actually succeed in life... They just happen to be born with a magic ticket called talent. If you don't have it, you can either accept or deny that fact until you die. That's your only choice. Once you realize that, all you have left in life is despair. The ultimate game over. I think that's a naive, a naive way of thinking, but fits with Adachi. I think that if you don't have a talent immediately in what you're doing, if your life is in Nowheresville and it's not going the way that you want, you can make changes, you can find something else. There'll always be something that you can do. There'll be people who are better than you, people who are worse than you. But you can always find something, right? Like, you don't necessarily have to be good at the first thing that you do. Sounds like what Adachi did, from what we were heard about him, in his younger years, he was an overachiever, but you know, no, he, nobody challenged him, right? He was he was constantly bored. I think his life was mediocre but he felt that it could be more so he, he thought i'm gonna join the police at least i'll get to carry a gun it'll be interesting right i'll get to solve crimes sherlock holmes all that sort of stuff wasn't interesting wasn't interesting at all and he got sent out into the middle of nowhere and he just couldn't cope and then he, he he's just snapped he's convinced himself that the problem is the world and not himself like he can He's he convinced himself that he cannot change because he there is no problem with himself. Therefore, you know, it's the world that's at fault. And then once you started twisting your mind in that thought, you got right. Okay, the world's at fault. So therefore, you know, the world is a problem. Like the world, the world is in of itself the issue. The world in of itself doesn't deserve anything. You know, there's no reason to preserve it. No re and then, you know, this is where the spiral down went. That's the way I see Adachi in my head. Anyway. Wouldn't it be better if that kind of reality was wiped away? That's complete BS! Brats like you are so damn naive. You piss me off. Listen, 
You might have hopes and dreams right now, but that's only because you know nothing about reality. One day you'll see. You'll be faced with a boring reality that boxes you in, no matter where you go. You're the only boring thing here! Uh, not, not your best comeback, Kanji. If you want to disappear, go ahead! Stop dragging us into it! <sighs> Stop yelling, punk. I understand you're all afraid and gotta act tough to cover it up, but jeez. I'm telling you all this based on my own experience in life. Think about it for a second. Once everyone turns into shadows, they'll still keep on living, oblivious to all the things around them. So how's that different from the way it is now? No, this'll make things much easier for everyone. Easier? What the hell are you talking about? Come on, how many people out there actually think about what's real or what's right and wrong? Next to none, I bet. It's useless to think about those things in the first place. You don't get anything out of facing reality, and there's no way to change it either. I mean, what could be more boring than brooding over things you can't change? It's better to just ignore them and believe only what you want to believe in life. Doesn't that sound a lot easier? It would be awesome if everyone's life could be that easy. No matter who you are, your lifespan is about 80 years or so, right? Uh... Very incorrect? There, there's many people whose lifespan is not 80 years or so. There's many people whose lifespan is a lot higher. There's many people whose lifespan is a lot shorter. So, no. Then it'd be easier if we all just became shadows. No need to hold back anything. No more pretending we don't see things. Honestly, we don't need our world anymore. Better to let it be swallowed up and for mankind to turn into shadows. That's what all those people who are scared to death really want. So it's my duty to see that they get it. Nobody wants anything like that! It's just you, dumbass! Jeez, don't you remember what it was like when your shadow came out? It must have been enjoying life far more than you. Oh. Be careful! I don't know what's happening! Thanks, Teddy. You all saw shadows as mere monsters, didn't you? These things move on pure instinct. They go wild because you defy them. You annoying little brats are the ones who are wanted in the new world! Speak for yourself! Living is too painful for you, but you don't want to die? Of course no one would understand. It makes no sense. You're just throwing a tantrum like a kid who can't have his way. People can't live alone. If you give in and sever your ties to human society, it will naturally become hard to live in it. Yet you refuse to face life and admit your fault, running from your own humanity like a coward. And though you claim to find life troublesome, you cause nothing but trouble for many others. Your twisted logic is that of an immature, egotistic brat! Shut up! Stop, Stop trying to act, act all tough! You guys, guys can't, can't even stand, stand on your own, unless, unless you, you deny, deny everything, everything I said! Stupid teenagers! You have no idea what kind of shit I've been through! Favored by the world, my ass! I'm gonna say it flat out! You're just a worthless criminal! Here he comes. This will probably be our last battle. Let's hit him with everything we've got. Wait. No, it's it's not going to be our last battle. Oh. We just have Adachi as he is. The world is about to change. Because, of course, Adachi in of itself, like, he is a shadow. His shadows are just pure instinct, and they're just doing whatever they want. You know, immediately first thing, just do it. Then Adachi is pretty much that, right? He is one of one in the same. Your existence won't belong there. I thought I could just leave you be, but you're like a plague. I'll have to get rid of all of you. I wish we could get rid of you, but we'll make sure you pay for what you've done. Shut up! Get lost! Get the hell out of my sight! I can't believe he's the one. 
That bastard! We can't lose, no matter what! This one's strong. Watch yourselves. All right. Just want to double check. We have null physical. Okay. We're also null on darkness, which and repelling light. So we can't be insta-killed. We're immune on physical. So we can only be hit by fire and uh, and wind. And then they're neutral. Okay. That's fine. I think we're going to stick on this one here. I'm Debilitate? Decreases attack, and defense, and hit evasion for one foe. Do it. Nice. Alright, raise all of our stats. Then raise our attack. So what I've done so far is I've raised our attack. I've raised our hit and evasion. And I've then lowered his attack, defense, and hit and evasion. So this is our first proper attack. Hit him with heavy fire. Let's see how this goes. That, that worked. Heat riser. He has a persona. A persona? But that can't be! Interesting. Was that Izanagi he had? I think he just removed my debuffs. All right, well, you know. Reapply. Yeah, see how you like that. Let's go for some wind. Okay, I've raised our attack. That's all I need to do right now. Um, I could raise our defense. Sure, let's raise our defense. I know Teddy already has a defense, but oh wait, well, I guess we already had one. That's fine, whatever. Fire. Alright, that's AoE Wind. That's what looks a lot like is an uh, is an Ami. So it must be the other one. Okay, so he didn't remove that from himself. Wonderful. Let's mind charge ourselves. Nice. Um just hit him with winds. It seems too easy, actually. I think it's got to have a phase two. Um, let's try ice. That was fine. Fire. Damn breaths! Shut up and let me finish you off. Okay, the Kaja, what's that? All stat increases nullified. Okay, you still have the stat decreases. Yeah, yeah, yeah. A uh, mind charge isn't a stat increase, so uh, let's hit him with the almighty damage and see how this goes. Three hundred and ten. Damn it! Okay. They think they are. Uh, reapply this one. To increase our hit evasion. That's absolutely fine. Persona. Ooh, what are you giving us? Healing? Uh, attack increase, nice. Uh, I'm gonna increase our defense, because that seems like a really useful one. So, evasion and defense are very good ones to start with. Let's do a heal. This is solid. Yeah, he's not doing anything crazy. We are gonna reflect that back at him again. And he takes damage from it, so I mean, that's fine. It's absolutely okay. Um, is this still applied? Yeah. Let's try this. Zeodyne. Actually, I think it deapplies this turn, but that's okay. Um, one of those. Wind. Okay. Raise our attack. So that should mean that we hit for a lot of damage. Okay. Uh, fire. Yeah. Damn it! You're all such a pain in the ass. I'll kill you, just like I did those other ones. All right. Yeah, that all reverted this turn. Purple blades, heavy physical. We're we're immune, which is good. 
Yeah, uh, debilitate again. I love that this works on him. It's just basically like, well, you can't do anything. Okay. Continuing to hit him with heavy power moves. Uh, we actually have a turn spare as we're not lowering his defense because we already lowered his defense. Let's just try heavy physical. Let's see how this goes. I'm going to heal anyway, so. Pretty much nothing. Okay. Heal. <laughs> now, is that because Teddy's really bad at physical moves? <laughs> Could be. Or is that because physical's not that good on him? Warple Blade. I mean, we block, so it's fine. Uh, Mind Charge. Next turn we hit him, then we debilitate again. Okay. So actually, I just realized, as long as we Mind Charge for every attack, it's going to be debilitate, Mind Charge, hit, debilitate. And we can do that every, we can just do that in a circle. Great. Increase our defense, because that was about to wear off. In fact, it did wear off on some of ours. Neat. Um, yes, him with fire. Nice. Bastards. There's no way I can lose. It makes no sense. I can't lose. Well, we're immune to that. Sorry. Nice try, though. I appreciate the effort. 513 damage. I love it. Giving us more attack. All charged up and focused. Okay. Uh, what's your hit like if you just hit him? It's not that bad. I mean, it's not as good as some others, but you know, it's not that bad. Raise our attack. Yeah, it was going to wear off next turn. That's fine. Yeah, hit him with fire. Fear. Now that fear is the one that then uh, allows the darkness one to be an, an automatic hit, isn't it? Oh, doesn't matter. We just removed it. <laughs> okay, debilitate. Apply that for longer. Nice. Um, hit him with one of these. I think that's going to be the kill. Yeah. 600 damage. Is that it? That doesn't seem like it. I'm sorry, that doesn't seem like it. Damn, this is lame. Oh well, our world's gonna disappear soon, no matter what. I didn't have anywhere to go back to anyways. Everyone's gonna become shadows. <laughs> Yeah, there we go. All humans will become shadows, and I shall descend upon the United World as the Master of Order. Descend? Order? What's with this guy all of a sudden? What's happening? Guys, this isn't a dachi. It's someone completely different. Both this world and yours will soon be enclosed in a fog that never lifts. It will be the peaceful world that mankind has longed for. Who are you? I am Amino Sagiri. Am I meant to know that name? One who rules the fog. One awakened by man's desires. Do what you will, but your world's erosion cannot be stopped. It is an inevitability. You played your part well, stirring up the will of the masses into madness. But that will soon come to an end. Mankind will soon become shadows and live on in the darkness of the fog, oblivious of their reality. What the hell are you? Why are you doing this? I am the one that shepherds humans to their true desires. Though their hearts longed for peace, it could never be attained. So they tore down the wall between image and reality. Indeed, 
This is the outcome desired by mankind. And mankind's desires are my desires. That is why I decided to expand this world. You're saying you're the one who created this nasty-ass world? This is part of the sea of unconsciousness that exists within human hearts. A hollow forest born from bloated desire and false imagery. Humans view things as they see fit. They wish not for truth, but rather prefer the undesirables be hidden in fog. Still, humans fear what they cannot see. That brief yearning for truth becomes a ray of light which breaks the fog and torments the shadows. That's why they attack and kill whoever's nearby at that time. A hollow forest. Then, this place isn't simply affected by people's hearts. It actually exists inside them? Mankind abandoned its pursuit of truth, placing itself in the depth of chaos and falsehood. Thus, my strength has grown, and the fog will not lift. Your world will be engulfed by the hollow forest. Will you shut up already? We'll just use our power to beat the heck out of you and it'll all be over. I mean, Chie, I wasn't going to say that, but you know, that, that was my plan. It was I who made it possible for you to bring about this destiny. I bestowed power onto those who could brave the hollow forest. That is what allowed you to come in contact with this world. And you all have done very well since. Bestowed power? Contact with this world? You mean the power to enter the TV? Then the Midnight Channel, was that phenomenon also your doing? Humans fail to see things as they truly are. They choose to see only what they wish. I acted only in support of this. A world filled with desires, viewed through a window from which one sees what one wishes to see. Humans departed from reality of their own volition, craving more false images. A window that shows people what they want to see. So that's why those who got famous suddenly appeared on the Midnight Channel, one after another. It was all in people's minds. I have to say, it must be true. The Midnight Channel we saw in Namatame's hospital room, that kept bothering me since. What we saw there wasn't Namatame's true intentions at all. Then it came on because we were all thinking, this person must be the killer, he can't be forgiven? Hmm, okay. So, what we were seeing in the TV wasn't like their inner selves, so it wasn't like Yukiko's inner self, it wasn't Kanji's inner self. It was people's views of them? Doesn't quite line up. I'm... We'll keep going. <laughs> we let ourselves be deluded. Exactly. The more false images one yearns for, the more one stops yearning for reality. Or maybe it might just be the people who are on the Midnight Channel are chosen by like a, th a thought poll. And then, you know, from that point onwards, it's all as we believed. And so the forest grows on. That is the expansion of this world. Enough talk already! Long story short, you're the one behind all this! Yeah, I don't know who you are, but you're going down! People want to become shadows? Their desire is your desire? To hell with that! When did we wish for that crap anyways? We kept fighting and fighting like morons to get where we're standing! Yes, that I did not foresee. The ability to master your own shadow that emerged to kill you and use its power. A new and uncertain facet of mankind. Is it worthy to put my trust in or not? It must be tested. Oh, wow.
Uh-huh. So this is the cause of all the fog? Indeed. I have come to put you all to the test and judge your worth. Like, we give a damn what you came for! You've done what you want so far, but that'll end when we crush you! Precisely. Then we know what we gotta do now. I don't want people to turn into shadows. We'll defeat it for sure. I'll back you up with everything I've got. This thing has no right to exist. <laughs> so this is the real boss then? I should have seen that coming. To defy me is a senseless act which goes against your world's wishes. Now, let everything vanish into the sweet fog of illusion. Man, nah, let's not do that. This is the end. This time, it's all over. It's huge. Let us begin. We didn't get an SP increase. Are you? Kidding me? All right, fine. Uh, debilitate. Boom. I mean, it seemed like an obvious first move. Raise all of our uh, evasion. Again, seems like an obvious first move. Uh, increase. We already did that. Um, increase attack. Cool. All right, Yukiko, you get hit number one. Make it a good one. Okay, wasn't too bad. Wind. God's judgment. Yeah, wasn't too bad. Uh, mind charge. We can probably get one hit off, and then we need somebody to give us SP. That's okay. Okay. Uh. Actually, you know what? We can get somebody to give us SP on this turn. We got time. Let's just choose a Soma. I know it's a little bit of a waste, but... Yeah. As they, I think it's the right turn to use it on right at the start. So we just increased our attack. I'm going to try Ice. I don't expect Ice is going to be good, but... That's fine. And we can hit it with another Fire. Nice dodge. God's judgment. Okay. Not a problem. Hit it with one of these. That was really good. I like that one. Alright. Uh, wind. Any of the other ones good? He hasn't got any stat bonuses on himself yet, so... Wind seems good. Okay. So we lowered its def so wait so saying so we get raised our attack we did that uh yeah I think we just hit it for ice that's okay I should have tried normal hitting it actually yeah okay here I think I might heal I could have healed on Teddy's turn but it's not a big deal I really only needed one heal. Nice miss. God's judgment. That hit again. Okay. Uh, debilitate again. Definitely seems like a useful one to spam. Right. Um, that means that this is going to run off this turn as well. To so reapply that. Persona. Oh, hello. You getting another attack? Oh, we got a charge. Nice. Attack and defense reverted. Uh, increase our defense. That's priority number one is defense. Priority number two is attack. Right. Uh, yeah, I should just... Actually, this is, this is a better heal. It's cheaper. <laughs> That's all right. Garudine. Nice miss. Was this one? Oh, fire. I see. We blocked it and everyone else dodged. Great. 
Right, mind charge. Already in effect. Ah, okay. Hit it with this then. Oh wait, no, it's already in effect because of um, because of Reese. Oh, okay, yes. Um, so I just used that. Yes, let's use wind, which should be in effect. Nice 400 damage hit. Raise our attack. That's very good. Uh, try just attacking it. Okay. Why act against the wishes of your fellow man? Consider, is that truly just? Nebulous Oculus? Oh, alright. Sure. Okay. Your persona, Senpai, hang in there. Somebody else can remove that. By somebody else, I mean Yukiko. So I just did that one. Uh, let's use this. Actually, just for safety, Teddy, heal yourself. Cool. And then we'll apply the Amrita. Which is why we brought two healers along. <laughs> right. Well, at least we got to uh, reflect that one. All stat decreases nullified. And then you get another turn, okay. Look, nice that that missed us. Okay, debilitate. Obviously we want to reapply that one. Because it's a huge one to have like applied. You're gonna pay, damn it! Love that you get to stand up, because that means that we can reapply this to ourselves. Great. Ooh, what are we getting? Attack or a charge? Charge! It missed Teddy, unfortunately, but that's okay. Defense reverted. Okay, apply the defense buff again. Okay, we're back to where we were. I like, we can apply all of our buffs in one turn. It's great. Uh, Probably just hit it, actually, for this turn. Yeah. It's not bad. Fire is a good one for it to apply. The silence is a pain in the uh, backside, but that's okay. Um, Garudine. Ooh, we probably want to we want to do Amrita and we want to do heal. Um, we could. Oh, you know what we could do? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, where, where's where's the party version of this. Yeah, we'll use a Maca Leaf. There we go. That works. Then we can apply the Am- then we can use Amrita and remove everything. I probably want to reapply its debuff this turn in case we get silenced again. How foolish. Your actions will draw many back into suffering and strife. Why will you not understand this? Bewildering fog. Panic. Release the fog something. Mind charge. I don't know what you're gonna hit me with. So I'm gonna guard. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, you know what? I was thinking about it. I think I might just guard this one. Really? You know what? Debilitate. Attacks won't connect. Ah. No, 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 no. This isn't good. This is a very bad situation for us. No, no, no. I, I would, I would still guard. I think Teddy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Wildering fog. Fog is cleared. Well, it missed us. <laughs> Which is good. Alright, debilitate. 
Nice. Careful, guys. Teddy's health is reapply this. Teddy, reapply our defense buff. And then I think I'm gonna heal on Yukiko's turn. I'm gonna use her heal. I'm not gonna use a Maca Leaf, Careful, but guys. You're yeah. Really low on health. Uh, yeah. You think I didn't notice that? Thank, thank you, Reese. I really appreciate being told I'm low on health. Well, we're still alive. Okay. So we debilitated last turn. Mind charge? Already in effect. Ah, lightning bolt. <laughs> 500 damage, always nice. You know, it might be a Macaleaf situation. On the other hand, it might be value medicine. Yeah, val let's use value medicine. That at least puts us all in an okay situation. Increase our attack. And then we can heal and we're gonna be near full. Right, heal. Three misses and a hit. Three misses and a hit again. All right, that's fine. Okay, so I didn't mind charge. I debilitated, I lightninged. I should mind charge and debilitate. Yeah, okay. Good. Um, you can just hit, I think. That's all right. Um, I think we'll just do a self-heal here. I just realized the double attack up doesn't actually mean we have a double attack. The double attack up means that you have a charge ready. That's what that means. We already learned that before. Okay, that's fine. Persona. Giving me charge again? Yeah, okay. Miss Teddy. I will bring about the deaths of those who will keep true peace from the world. Quake? Three misses and a hit Teddy? Oh, it's, it's peacing out again. Okay, we can't debilitate it. What do we do? Uh... Restores all of one ally's HP. Uh, you know what? Let's Tetracorn us. Get up! Seems like a good one. Nice recover. Uh, let's buff us with the ability to dodge. Yeah. Reapply our defense uh, thing here. That seems like a good move. And then guard next turn, I think. Uh, we don't need to heal. Uh, we got another item that might be good. Gives one ally a lack, wind is resistance. Um, bead melon, probably not. Uh, just seeing what else we got here. Well, I could. I could use that, actually, on Yosuke, because he does have problems with the leg. All right. Mind charge. So next turn it's going to hit, in theory. So this turn we want to guard, I think. Okay, it's up. Fog is cleared. Oh, we can just hit it with debility. All right. Toot toot. All, all of your buffs are gone. <laughs> all right, reapply this. I mean, apart from the charge one. The charge buff is still there. 
yeah, reapply defense. I can't remember whether we need to or not, but... Yeah, yeah, we didn't need to. But I felt it was safe, safer to do it than not do it. Uh, and then I'm actually going to heal Teddy. I know we didn't attack on this turn, but that's okay. Because we knew it's going to do a mind-charged version of this. It hit us, but we're okay. Luckily, we reflect that one. Dead Teddy. Okay. Should be able to uh, fix him, though. Already in effect. Okay. Senpai, you're low on health. Be careful. Zeodyne. Nice. Uh, revival bead on Teddy. Uh, where is it? Revival bead. There we go. Raise him up. Okay, Teddy. Uh, I'm going to need a uh, good heal from you here. Yeah, let's use a Maca Leaf. That seems to be pretty good. Okay. Um, hit it with this because we have a we have a charge up. At least it does something then. All stat increases nullified. That was just a basic attack. Okay. Uh, I didn't mean to apply that, but that's okay. Or equip that quickly anyway. Uh, it's that reverted. Let's give ourselves the dodge and hit. That's okay. That's still working the way we want it to. So then we can reapply our defense up. This is a very slow way of playing this game that I've discovered. I've no I noticed that this is incredibly slow. This buffing strat. But, you know. It seems to be working for just now. Thank you for nullifying all the stat increases. Quake is physical? So we have Tetracorn. Never mind, we dodged it. Uh, I'm sure we still have Tetracorn active, but I guess we, we dodged so it doesn't use it. Uh, revival bead on Yosuke. Okay. Shouldn't someone heal Yukiko Senpai? <sighs> yes, somebody should heal Yukiko Senpai. Or we have nothing that's gonna get down fixed. Let's give ourselves the buffs again. Let's try that again. Persona. Heal. You just give me charge again. Recovered SP. I'm oh, that's. Still that, that is by far the best thing you could have done right now. Recover SP. Oh, wow. Okay. That's huge. Do, do this. Shouldn't someone heal Yukiko Senpai? Yeah. AoE heal. Well, the only person who's in danger is Yukiko. Luckily, they use Quake first. Are you okay? The nice thing about using Quake first is that we didn't have lowered defense for it. The negative is that we now have to reapply all of these buffs. Alright, debilitate again. Oh, I just need to hit the boss. Is this one worth reapplying? Yeah, it is. I hate it, but it's worth reapplying. So. Right. Reapply the defense buff as well. It is, it is worth reapplying, that's the problem. Uh, and then we need to heal, which is also worth doing. And then you just nullify it. Maybe I only need to apply one and it'll just nullify the one. Nice, okay, well at least we get this turn. Oh, we didn't have mind charge in effect. Okay. I thought I'd test it. Okay. New plan. I'm gonna apply this. Give us extra dodge. And then I'm just gonna attack the boss with Teddy. Hit it. And with Yukiko. We did 200 damage. So they still apply that. Cool. 
Quake. Hate that one. At least we dodged it. Okay. Zeodyne. We need to give ourselves SP. I think I might use one of the ones to give us a full SP in uh, HP. I might use another Soma. Hopefully we'll get more of these at some point in the future. <laughs> right. Uh, reapply our defense buff so that at least they'll remove our buff. Basically I'm only reapplying the buff so they'll remove our buff. That's the whole reason I'm applying that buff now. Is just so they'll remove it. What are you giving us? Give us charge, please. Would love charge. Attack. Alright. Well, that's fine. Oh! Double attack and we dodged it. Nice. Okay. Debility. Just keep that on there. Hit with heavy uh, winds. Now, they didn't lower our stats last turn, so actually we can just keep going on it this turn. Fire. We're getting there. There's the lowered stats. Yeah. They just keep missing, though, which is brilliant. Uh, try this. Does this even do more damage? I didn't even check. I did check earlier, didn't I? We're getting there. Garudine. I think I'm gonna apply a defense buff again. If the defense buff is so good if they actually hit us with the buff up. That's the thing. Uh, and then fire. It might be the kill. That looks like a kill to me. Slow and steady. Few items used, but you know. We got there in the end. I see. Your powers are strong. Power comes from the heart. You have proven to me human potential. Very well. I will lift the fog from the place where you will return to. Can you stop mumbling? Mankind's desires are my desires. If mankind so wishes, I will return at any time. I am always at your side. Watch it. Well, don't wait up! We'll keep that from happening no matter what! Time will show the path humanity takes. Children of the new potential. You think it was controlling Adachi-san? No. I think it found Adachi-san as a likely person who it like it found Adachi-san as somebody who it could work with. You know, it was in the right situation. It, it, was, it was the perfect person who you could pull the levers behind him, control his strings, mix metaphors, all that sort of stuff. Who can say? I believe it was at least partially his own intention as well. Yeah. So that's it, huh? <clears> hmm. <throat> Fine. Live however you want. If you think you have the power to change the future, then go right ahead. Everyone has the power to do that. <laughs> Get out of here. The shadows will finish me off. No, 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 no. You don't get off that easy. Just leave me be. You came to kill me in the first place, didn't you? Nope. No, dumbass. If we leave you here dying, and a dead body eventually appears, then what? That's cold, Yosuke. Is that your reasoning? What's that accomplished for anyone? 
Your stupid game's over. We're taking you back. Live and face your punishment. That's how it works in our world. Oh, you see, what I thought he meant by this, right? Is a dead body will appear. I thought he meant that means people won't think it's over. And I thought that was what he was implying. No, he was implying what I was implying. Right. I'm sure that's the outcome Dojima-san wishes for as well. We have the same power, but things turned out so differently for us. You can still start over. Easier said than done. But maybe if I had been more like you, things wouldn't have gone this way. Adachi is smiling weakly. You can sense Adachi's sincerity. You feel as if you finally understand Adachi. Hunger, rank 9. Let's go back. Interestingly, there's still one more rank. At last, you and your friends have thwarted the cause of all the strife. Yeah, sure. That's why we're rank 9. We've because we've thwarted the final boss. Sure. Sure game. There is nothing more. Greetings, Shirogane-san. We got word from Detective Dojima. He's wanted on suspicion of murdering Mayumi Yamano and Saki Konishi, right? Correct. Understood. We have an ambulance waiting downstairs. Should we have them bring the stretcher up here? An ambulance? Detective Dojima assumed one would be necessary. He wanted the suspect to be carefully taken into protective custody. It... Well, it was a personal favor to him. They were partners, after all. Then yes, please have them bring up the stretcher. Understood. And achievement breaking through the fog. Oh, there's no fog everywhere. It's so much nicer. Oh, do you see on the right-hand side? Oh, on the left-hand side, we have uh, the Saizu Daigaku, or, or Sozai Daigaku, whatever that restaurant's called. I just noticed on the right-hand side, we have the husband from it, just underneath Chie. Just thought it was a nice touch for the NPC they chose. We did it. This time it's for real. W what's up, senpai? Did you think I was crying? It's just so bright. It's been so long since the sky was that blue. It's finally over. Thank you. Hey, don't get all sappy. We did this together. But, well, this means we've won. Uh-huh. Huh? What are we doing? Ooh, what's this? Everyone ready? Here goes! We did it! Woohoo! Why didn't you guys say it? You all joined in when Risa-chan did it! Um, I think that was a little too hard to get on the spot. Which part did you mean for us to say? Can we just do it over? Man, having to redo something like this kind of kills the fun of it. All right, Chia, do that weird call again. 
Not if you're gonna call it weird. <laughs> um, people are beginning to stare. I don't think we should stay like this much longer. Um, my hand's getting kind of sweaty. Sheesh. Fine, then. It's all yours, Sensei. Okay, then say, woohoo. You don't need to explain it again. Sheesh, then I'll say it. Everyone ready? Here goes. We did our best. Woohoo! Kanji could not have sounded more bored. With everyone's help, you were finally able to lift the fog in closing the town. Alright, is rank 10. Let me just go for the... I don't believe you. Uh-huh, 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 yeah, 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 yeah. You're making a big deal out of this. Thou art I, and I am thou. Thou hast established a genuine bond. These genuine bonds shall be your eyes to see the truth. We bestow upon thee the ability to create Lucifer, the ultimate form of the Judgment Arcana. We have forged a bond that cannot be broken. By mastering the Judgment Social Link, you can now fuse Lucifer, the Rebel King of Hell. Dude, aren't you supposed to do this before you start something, not after it's over? Huh? Who cares? The battle has finally come to an end. The one behind everything has withdrawn, and the fog enclosing the town has lifted. And... 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 Would you like to save your progress thus far? I thought so. I thought there was more. Alright, it automatically moves to the 23rd, like we thought. The 23rd of December, evening. Christmas Eve is tomorrow. Also, given that this is evening, does this not imply that they should have done the dungeon on the 23rd? Oh well. Whatever. I missed one afternoon. The screen reads, two new messages. Yukiko's message. It's Christmas Eve tomorrow. Would you like to spend time with me? Just the two of us. How does that sound? Ah. I see. Spend time with Yukiko. What's the second message? Oh, the second message would be spend time with somebody else. I understand. So this is the spending time with people ones. You invited Yukiko to your house for a romantic evening on Christmas Eve. My parents booted me out of the house tonight. I was helping out like normal, but my parents said I was bothering them. They're being overprotective. I can go out on a date without any help. <laughs> but I like them so much. Yukiko seems to be enjoying Christmas with you. Oh, thanks for the cake. It looks really delicious. By the way, I have a present for you. A present? Obtain the leather keychain. I know you won't be staying in Inaba forever. I want you to take that when you go, for me. Since I'm going to be staying here, in this town. Hmm. <laughs> I should stop talking about gloomy stuff like that. We've solved the case. I want today to be fun. Hmm. I've been wondering why I like you. It can't be helped. <laughs> You're so confident. At first, I was interested in you. When I realized that, I was already going after you. It's tough that you'll be leaving, but I have to accept the truth. You had a wonderful Christmas Eve with Yukiko. Um, what else do people do during Christmas? Did we eat that entire cake? Bean is always busy during this time of year, so I've never spent a Christmas night like this before. I've never had a boyfriend either. 
I'm so happy that you're my first boyfriend. Hmm. Hmm. That's not the first time I've had that thought. Hmm? Um... Huh? Can I... stay here tonight? Uh, I told my mother that I'd spend the night at Chie's place. So I can stay here without anyone minding. I... I love you. Oh my. Christmas Eve continues. Near the end of the year, December 25th, Juness at the usual food court. So the case is closed for reals this time. I think we can safely leave the rest to the police. Adachi has confessed his crimes, so I'm sure Namatame's presumed guilt will be re-examined as well. I see. Then that really wraps it up. What do you do now, Teddy? You're not going back over there, are you? You better not, you dumb bear. You don't know how much you worried us last time. I won't suddenly disappear like that again. Damn straight you won't. Man, just stay here, all right? It's Dojima. Hey, it's me. Hey, you're on your hospital gown. Good news. It looks like they're letting Nanako come home for a bit. She's awake again, and she's got a good amount of strength back, too. If all goes well, she might be able to leave the hospital for the time being. And as for me, they said I just needed to see a doctor regularly. So I'm planning to come home with Nanako today. Sorry I had to stick you with all the housework. I'll make up for it somehow. Anyway, see you later. You told everyone about Dojima's message. Really? Nanako-chan's coming home? I I'm so happy for her. Me too. I'm really glad. The fog's all gone over here because everyone tried so hard. And now Nanako-chan's gotten better! Nanako-chan tried hard too. She... She's such an amazing girl. <laughs> Seriously. Thank heavens she's okay. Where are you touching? Oh dear. It was too wholesome a moment. Well, one thing certain. It's party time! Excellent. Let's throw a big Christmas party for Nanako-chan! Yeah, just what somebody who needs rest needs. A party, you say? I'm sure Nana-chan will be delighted! We'll need a cake then. Yeah, you know, I had this cake, Yukiko. Um, it was a full-on Christmas cake. It could have fed, like, ten people. What happened to it? Do you know? G guys please say you're not gonna... Huh? We're gonna make one. Of course we're gonna make one. I've already researched the ingredients. Did you not just get, like, a call on the caterpillar from the uh, supermarket? See, that's, that's a very British reference. Hey, wait, wait a sec, whoa there! Is it Colin, or is it Henry? It's a caterpillar. It, it's, it's a thing. That's way too tall an order for you! Let's go to the grocery department! Come on, Natto-kun, you too! B but I've never baked a cake. Don't worry, neither have we! Oh dear. It's so warm! Ah, uh, there's our new Kotatsu with the oranges on top to stop people being cold. Yeah, yeah. We're, we're with the references. So this is the fabled Kotatsu. I was really looking forward to the new Kotatsu. 
Yeah, you talked about it all the time at the hospital. Nanako needs to go back for a full checkup early next year, but if they don't find anything wrong, they'll let her go immediately. If I'd gotten better sooner, we would have been able to buy the Katatsu together. Sorry. Oh, I forgive you. Don't worry about it. Okay. Next time, let's go together. Sorry for the wait! Oh, no. The Christmas edition of Mystery Food X is about to be served. I don't think Dojima's seen the previous food offerings. Bring it on. I'm ready. Got my insurance card and everything. That is a large cake. Also, it kind of looks edible. Hey, this is bigger than I imagined. Also, it has a very intricate house on top. They bought this one. Wait, Nanako-chan! I'll be the first one to... No! It's delicious! It tastes really good! They bought it. Th that can't be. No. Has she lost all sense of taste? She's right. It's like nothing you've tasted before. Did you guys really make this? Not a chance. That's far too intricate in terms of all of that work on top. Huh? Uh, of course we did. Nah. Does it actually taste like something? It's not hot, is it? How is it, Kanji? Hmm? It, it's amazing! You know what they say about true talent not needing to show off. Turns out we had good taste in cooking after all. <sighs> then again, this one was our third attempt. See, Naoto said that they did it, and now I'm like, maybe my theory's wrong. But at the same time, like, that little house on top is well detailed. Hey, Yosuke! Chie-chan and the others really are talented chefs! Three stars for sure! I impossible! This actually tastes good! I love that Dojima's just sitting there with a scowl on his face still. Wait, I didn't already pass out, did I? This isn't a dream, right? Um, Nana-chan, guess what I have? Ta-da! A Christmas present for you! It- you're giving a Christmas present of a smaller version of yourself. Alright. Oh, he looks just like you! I wish I could have made it look better. But I thought it'd keep you company at the hospital, Nana-chan. Oh, and it's made from 100% pure teddy fur. I'm a guy who's all about using all natural materials. I isn't that nice of him, Nanako? <laughs> Dojima's not sure what to make of it, but still trying to get Nanako to uh, have proper manners. Teddy fur. You, Teddy. I have to thank you all again. Adachi confessed to the two murders. He insists it was him who hung the bodies, too. There are still things that are unclear about his story, but he's most likely going to pay for his crimes. Anyway, this was one strange case. If what you said about a world inside the TV was true, then everything might make sense. Oh, I still don't believe it. Some things in this world just can't be explained. Like Nanako. She made a miraculous recovery, and now she's as healthy as ever. Back in the day, my own senpai on the forest told me something. There's an underside to everything that you can never see. This case has made me think about a lot of things. You've helped us out so much. It was meant to be the other way around, really. There isn't much time left until spring, 
But I hope I can do some catching up until then. That's right. You're only here until spring, huh? Senpai, you're going back? It won't be the same without you. Sensei? Are you going somewhere? I'll stay in your hearts. Senpai, that's one hell of a cliche. I could not say it. But hell with it. I got nothing against a line like that. Come on, spring's a long ways off, right? Let's have all the fun we can until then. <laughs> hey, don't get too carried away. My sis would kill me if you got yourself held back a year. I've still got this slight itch in the back of my head. I'm like, if it skips to March, that means somewhere along the line, we've we've messed up and we've gone down the wrong ending route. Oh, but then you wouldn't have to go back, huh? Wow, if that happened, I'd be in the same grade as Senpai. Um, call me Senpai anyway? Alright, didn't matter what I said then, I guess. You received a Christmas costume from Dojima. It seems it was originally supposed to be used in a festival at the police station. Alright, 26th. Free day? No, it's school! Yo! Alright, I guess you have school on the 26th in Japan. Man, yes, it was great. We haven't had that much fun in a while. And there's no case to worry about anymore either. Let's just keep hanging out and having fun into next year, okay? Oh, that reminds me. Did you see the weather forecast? Looks like it's gonna rain tonight. Worried about the midnight channel? Yeah, it's been on my mind too. Since we beat Ameno Sagar Sagiri, uh, since we beat that Ameno Sagiri thing, the case should really be closed, right? I'm just a little skeptical, so you should check out the TV too if you have time. Okay, but we haven't seen a news story yet, so it's unlikely anyone's going to be on the Midnight Channel. Alright, I understand that you've all been very excited about the vacation, but we're having an end of term assembly in the gym now. Hehehe, <laughs> I'm so excited for winter break. I got this beautiful coat. Uh, oh, I, I guess it's just like you have a coat, not with you. All my adult charm is just going to come bursting out. Well, enjoy your winter vacation, everyone. Don't get too cozy or crazy. All right. I really need to save at some point. There we go. I really need to save at some point. I decided to go straight home, apparently. You're back. So you're home. It's been getting cold lately. You're not catching a cold or anything, right? It's not like a city here. You should wear another shirt over that. The weather report said it's going to snow tomorrow. If it snows, the veggies will catch a cold. Ha ha ha, it's alright, you don't have to worry. Alpac's gonna handle everything so that the vegetables don't get sick, right? Once it gets cold enough to snow, you will not be able to raise vegetables in the garden anymore. Okay. I'm gonna save in a new save slot. We are then going to exit out. Return to title menu. Why are we doing this? Well, I should have loaded data. You don't have to return to title menu, you can just load data. It, see, this is my mistake. Right, I'm gonna load up number eight because it was suggested that perhaps we should show off some of the other things. So, here's another thing. Hey, you sent us a message? Pass. One new messages. Can I see you tomorrow? It's Xmas Eve, you know. Yeah. You decided to spend time with Chie tomorrow. Okay. Let's see. And then we'll see whether I can get out. You invited Chie to your house for a romantic evening on Christmas Eve. Um, I'm kind of nervous because I've never spent a Christmas like this. And... I'm kind of amazed, too. Here I am, spending Christmas with you, and I didn't even know you last year. But now we're here together, 
And I feel happy. You know? Come on, say something. You're making me all embarrassed. Chie seems to be enjoying Christmas with you. Oh, that cake looks delicious. Good choice. Yeah, Yukiko liked it. Um, this is <laughs> from me. A fluffy muffler. I'm sure it'll look good on you. That's uh, that's a sure, that's a that, that's a name. I bought it, but I want to challenge myself and make one with my own two hands next year. And uh, I want to celebrate Christmas next year with you too. Of course. <laughs> You had a wonderful Christmas Eve with Chie. Right. Oh, it's this late already. Y you know, I, um... I told my parents I'll be at Yukiko's place tonight. Yeah, they're, they're both as bad as each other. They... They won't be worried if I'm with Yukiko. Plus, we've done lots of sleepovers at her place and my place before, so... So... Yeah... Oh, you know what I'm trying to say! Hey, wipe that grin off your face! Stupid... Hmm. Christmas Eve continues. Right, now is there a way out of here? Because I want to try one more thing. Ah, uh, we have to go through the whole lot? That's okay, it won't take that long. Now that we're not actually going through it. But yeah, I, I really like Chie's one, actually. That was good. Did I like it more than Yukiko's? Potentially. Yeah. You know what? I might make that my save. We'll see. Uh, Don't worry about it. Going through the exact same motions here. Okay, so then we eat some cake. We go, oh, did you really make it? Say it's the third attempt. Guess Naoto was the secret weapon in the cake making process. Um, I'll stay in your hearts. Kanji says that's fantastic. Yeah, 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 yeah. Call me senpai anyway, we chat. And then we go back to school. Right. And then skip our way through here. Say so you're still worried about Midnight Channel. Then we learn about her coat, which is going to bust out of. Right, then I can read this message, which I didn't read before, which is one of the reasons I want to go back. The closing ceremony has ended. The second term ends today. Okay. Right, evening. I think I'm going to make that my save. Yeah, 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 yeah. I think I'm going to make this my save. So we're going to save over nine. Okay. And then we're going to load up. Eight again. Why are we loading up eight again? Well, we've had Yukiko, we've had Chie. Let's uh, see what happens if we say no to both of them. Pass. Pass. Well, that's that then. It just skips the 25th. <laughs> All right. All right then. Well. What I think we're going to do is I'm going to end the episode there. Thank you for watching. And next time, we're moving on with Persona. We got Nanako back. We got Dojima back. Kodachi's in prison. The weird eye monster that spews out fog is gone. The game is just a clean run to the end doing social links. No issue. Just chill. Yeah? Yeah. Anyway, thank you for watching. I'll see you next time. Goodbye.